What up fam? So let me go over the cost, who did our graphics, how much that cost us, and why we choose the enclosed trailer. What's up fam? This is Vic from Quick Cuts Premium Lawn Care here in Conyers, Georgia. And as always, hope you guys are cutting on. What I wanted to do today is share with you the numbers of how much it costs us to get this enclosed trailer and also the benefits and who does our graphics. So first thing first, got an enclosed trailer, double wheels. Um, what did it cost us? It cost us like $6,100. So all in somewhere around $6,500 here in Conyers, Georgia. Now the thing is, it's an enclosed trailer seven by 14 it has lots of space i can get a 60 inch um more on this trailer versus my my other one plenty of room to get that trailer inside these doors right here okay fam now what i love about this one it has the, the double wheels that means i can carry more load yes it's more expensive than my smaller trailer but i can now carry a 60 inch more and also maybe if i want to two 60 inch more so we're going to use this trailer for our commercial lots on sunday now where do we get our graphics from it's the same guy we've been using city graphics what did he charge me basically he charged me somewhere around uh 600 700 bucks to put this all together nice print and the cool thing about it is I don't change my branding, whatever's on my truck, it's on my trailer. Here's my truck, same thing, nothing changed. So that branding, that logo, it's always the same. Same thing on my dump trailer over here. Keep everything same. Now, back to the trailer. Well, this year fam, I could not find uh, a u-haul the prices are ridiculous and plus i think due to the fact that amazon is buying up everything and people delivering amazon all over you know due to covid everyone's ordering things online man the online sales them blew up and i cannot find a u-haul so i know i needed another way of getting my equipment around so i had to invest in a trailer now i also probably going to buy a truck uh, another truck this year but only thing about it is most of the guys don't like or i don't like them driving the truck in the trailer so i'm also thinking about doing that um that um the truck ramp i'll let you know in a second whether or not we're going to do a truck ramp but right now it's truck and trailer because it does two things for me one it allows me to of course take my stuff wherever it needs to go but also store my equipment because what I was happening was I'm buying more equipment and I don't have no place to store it. And I don't want to buy a, uh, a shelter from any of the storage places. I got enough room on my, my own property. And I said, let me buy something that can store my equipment. And if I need to, I can go cut a yard with it. To know about other prices or other equipment prices, check out these videos right here. I share the prices in that one as well.